elite units of China's army, American trained and equipped, pressed for a junction with Stilwell's forces. In 1944, Chinese fighters backed by American air power routed the Japanese army from the border of China and Burma. They turned the tide of the war in continental Asia. The mantle of that victory is claimed by the Chinese Communist Party, which commemorates the end of the war with a military parade on September 3rd. But another side of the story is slowly being accepted in mainland China. Soldiers like 91-year-old Li Huiying fought that battle under the Chinese Nationalist, or KMT, army which ultimately lost the civil war to the communists. Today, their contribution is slowly being recognized in mainland China. Soldiers like Xu Benzhen, who rescued an American flying tiger pilot, are now sought after for their memories. This monument in Yunnan province is the only public memorial in China to soldiers who lost their lives fighting with the KMT. This Growing willingness to accept the role of the KMT could bring the nation, and old soldiers like Mr. Li, closer to reconciliation with China's troubled past. I'm Lucy Hornby, Financial Times, Beijing.